Hey everybody, my name is Bonnie Shalette. Um, I've been super humbled this week. Uh, people have asked for a tutorial about how I made this graphic uh, during a presentation by Holly Clark, Matt Miller, and Ken Shelton at FETC. Um, I do these kinds of sketch notes um, all the time when I go to conferences because I really personally struggle with paying attention even in a fantastic session like this one. Um, and so doing something like this helps me like organize my thoughts, um, think about what my key takeaways are, and just have something to help me remember. Um, I do all this in Canva. Um, if you're not on the Canva train yet, you should be. Um, this is my homepage. If you haven't used Canva before, they have tons of templates already done, right? Like they do all the heavy lifting. Um, I typed in AI on this particular um, graphic just because that was what the session was about found something that I thought was simple enough for me to type on, but still super cute. Um, I hit customize this template. Um, and so, like I said, I just use Canva, however it works for me. So you should do the same. You should find a system that works for you. Um, you might like this size. I prefer the Jamboard background size because um, I've been doing it so long. Um, now it's just like what I'm used to. Um, so you can see, and maybe this beautiful logo, all kinds of cool stuff. Um, and I just start playing on it. Um, so from here on the, on the left hand side, you're gonna have tons of options. Um, I use text, I tend to obsess over fonts a little bit, but I'm working on that habit right now. Um, I try to always put the link for the presentation if we have it um, at the top. Like I say, because that's like important, right? I want to refer back to that. Um, and I'll generally put it in the biggest. If I want to highlight something, I'll just go to elements, find a shape, put it behind it, um, and go from there. It's it's super simple. Um, like I said, you just have to find something that works for you. Um, Canva is super cool, too, about having your template colors like organized for you. So I liked this green. I was like, hey. I'm thinking to myself, I'd prefer this text in white. I have all of those options right there for me. Um, sometimes if I'm like, I know I can see myself typing a lot, I'll just duplicate my text boxes and kind of move them around so I have some places to go ahead and like pre-made type. Um, when something, like they said something cool, um, one of my favorite thoughts from this was like, what is cheating, right? Like is starting from a template cheating um is you know like what what is cheating with ai um i know i'm gonna run out of space so i decrease my line spacing a lot um because all these cool ideas right and then i try to find a picture that helps me like put it all together um i just go to elements type in question a lot of cool options i prefer I have a thing about things being animated, so I type in question animated. You can see the exact graphic that came up when I asked it that. Kind of make it smaller from here and just play around. Um, sometimes I group things. That way when I move it around, um, because I do that a lot. Like I, I move things around, I keep things that are bigger um, and smaller. Um, I know Holly talked a lot about information literacy. And it's important of that in our age. Um, same thing, like, and I was like, I really wanted to bring that home to myself. Uh, typed an animated circle. Um, you can see the one I used, it was the first one that came up. Um, and I moved that around. And I just as I go, I make things bigger and smaller. I bold, um, I try to group things so that later I can go back and reflect. Um, if this, I hope this helped you. Um, like I said, it was super flattered that people even asked me to show them how I did it. Um, once I'm done, I'll download it if I'm using it anywhere. Um, I download it as a GIF. Um, and so then I have that option. That's how I shared it out on Twitter. Um, it's going to download it. I also have a wakelet. I keep a wakelet of all these for myself as well um, to the side just so I can keep all this information from conferences in one place. So shout out to wakelet. Um, but let me know if I can help you with anything like this. Like I said, I do this all the time. So thanks for watching.